Hey fellow YouTubers, welcome to the Dustin TV. What? 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 What, Max? What, boy? What? What? Sorry about the... Sorry about that, guys. He wants some attention. Mm. Okay, guys. There was somebody was actually messaged me about what happened to all of your stuff. Okay. Um, I'm not going to mention her name, but here it is, guys. The reason why I lost, got my stuff taken away. It's because that I spent $900 on skirts like this. But they, this was my old one. But I lost my stuff. They did, didn't just take my skirts. They took my wrestling belts and some other stuff that I can't say on YouTube. But they took it July, August, August of 2020. Okay. My dad was really upset about it. Okay. He was pretty mad that I spent $900 on skirts and stuff like that. It was supposed to go on fixing my my uh, bathroom, put the new carpet down in the living room, in my bedroom, here in the spare bedroom, um, fix the floor in the bathroom where the toilet's at. But they took my stuff and kept it at my sister's house. Uh, let me see. See, this is what, this is what, happened really my sister was pretty upset with me about it and she says all your spending money is gone it's going to be put back the money that you spent and you won't get your stuff back until this year at the same time that we took your stuff that would be August okay August okay I was I was crying I had long hair I just wanted to show them that I could change my ways I literally cut my hair from my skirts and my wrestling belts my skirts are my private possession anyway you know, and then it got better, you know, a couple weeks. I mean, I really bust my ass helping my dad out, getting the eggs and cleaning up the kitchen or cleaning up the cook room and, you know, getting limbs out of the, the yard and stuff like that. And then my other... My others came in that I ordered, you know, they came in. I kept them away. Didn't say nothing about them. And that's when I told my dad that they was coming in. And I wanted to know if I could keep these because the progress I was doing. He said, well, they could be your Christmas present. I'm like, no. You just said... I could keep them because of the progress. I was doing good. He said, okay, you can go ahead and keep these. And and I mentioned, you know, I had $80. I always get $180 for Christmas. Only for Christmas. I got the $80. The $100 went to the trailer. And that's when... And that's when I ordered the rest of 
the rest of my Christmas after I got my, my, my stuff. Because, and the money that I got from my dad, you know, saved it up for the, you know, the work I was doing because I didn't have no spending money and all that. I bought, bought my Christmas after I got my stuff back. Because I knew I was going to get it back on the 31st, but I guess I got it back, uh, okay, Christmas, Christmas Day, the day after Christmas, I think it was Sun. I think it was Saturday or Sunday, I think it was Sunday that's when I got my, my stuff back, I got every bit of it back, that was the day when I went to my sister's house and you know, spent Christmas, our little, our get together for Christmas. On Christmas Day, we went to my, my stepmom's side of the family for Christmas Day. But let me tell you what happened. What happened, you know, during, the, during that time when, you know, I was so excited to get my skirts, my wrestling belts all back, okay? Get this. Before we ate catfish, yeah, we ate catfish and all that. Before we done that, I started feeling sick. My stomach started messing up. And I had to use the bathroom to have diarrhea. But I didn't have vomit. I didn't throw up or nothing. Well, I wasn't feeling too good. And everything, you know, Oh, you know, when the day kept on going, you know, I just didn't really feel too good at all. And Amy and Amy and Bo, Amy and Corbin, they was getting ready to go home. Okay, I didn't realize my other sister knew about what happened. Okay, she says, just keep up the good work to what you're doing. You're helping Dad out. You're doing a lot for dad. I said, okay, you know. And Debbie says, do you want to go ahead and get his stuff? I really didn't want to mess with it. Because you already know, I wasn't feeling too good. Well, we finally got it. And Corbin helped me get the rest of it. I mean, I was, I was not feeling too good. And we got home. I got all my skirts, all my all my belongings that, that they took from me, and I got them in the house. And <laughs> tell you the honest truth, I was really wasn't feel like doing it, but I did it anyways. I sorted the skirts out and started washing them a little bit. I washed all my pencil skirts first, and. I checked my belts, my wrestling belts. There was no damage or nothing. It was just in the, the other house that my sister bought. But that night, I did not eat anything. I didn't really want to eat anything for the last two or three days. I wasn't feeling too good. But that's the story. That's the reason why I, my stuff, when I put a video out, I got my stuff back. This is the reason why I lost my stuff. I got my stuff taken away. But, you know, if anybody wants to watch the video, understand why did I get rid got my stuff taken away. Because I spent $900 out of my first stimulus check. And that wasn't right for me to do that. It was supposed to go on the trailer, not my personal stuff. But I learned my lesson, and now and I'm not going to do that again. But guys, you will be seeing me a lot in a skirt and in, in a video. Haven't in a while, but you know I'm kind of glad I can do this in a skirt now. But I hope y'all enjoy the video and that's the reason why I'll, you know, my stuff was taken away from me, okay? 
and I'll see you on the next one.